State police in Somerset still investigating a rash of burglaries throughout that county. And so far, they tell us there have been at least 19 businesses broken into. And tonight, they're giving us a first look at one of the suspects. Maria Miller is live tonight with the details. Maria? Well, Marty, the first burglary we learned about happened at La Monica's restaurant back in mid-August. Since then, state police say there have been at least 18 other burglaries in the county. While they are not yet confirming if they're all related, they are releasing pictures tonight. Take a look. These are surveillance pictures police say were taken at Cantner Iron and Steel. Police say they believe the man in these pictures is involved in several burglaries throughout Somerset County. It's kind of hard to make out his face, but police say it appears the man has a limp. Specifically, they say his right foot turns in when he walks. La Monica's Restaurant, Green Gables, and Coal Miners Cafe are all restaurants in the Jennerstown area whose safes were broken into in early August. That same week, state police said someone attempted to break open an ATM machine at the first call. Commonwealth Bank, also in Jennerstown. Since then, police say Castagna's restaurant, First National Bank in New Centerville, Moss Dollar's restaurant and gas station, Taylor Construction, PBS Coles, The Laurel Mountain Inn, Doe Girls Pizza Shop, Stove Tops, Rick's Auto, Mart's Mini Mart, The Oakhurst Tea Room, and Somerset Door and Column were also targeted. That's at least six different areas of the county. Police say they're not sure if all 19 cases are related, but they do believe this man is involved in at least some of them. They also say he most likely had some help. Now, police say they don't yet have a combined total on how much was taken from all of those businesses. But as they continue to investigate tonight, they are, of course, asking for your help. Anyone with information should give them a call at the Somerset Barracks. That number is 814-445-4104. Reporting live, Maria Miller, 6 News.